This is the Real Ass Podcast. So some phone. kid stole my skateboard. So my, my sister's like, someone's taking our skateboard. And my uh, my mom was like, get in the car. And she like followed the kid and like got in his face. And I was like, I was such a pussy. And I was like, mom, no, he might have a knife or something. It was a Puerto Rican kid? No, it was a white kid with like red hair. Is that the guy that died on uh, the skateboard you were talking about? Probably. <laughs> yeah. The white, a, a fucking, a redheaded fucking yeah, ginger some, stole some your gin- fucking skateboard. Yeah. And my mom like followed him in the car. And then he was like waiting uh, on the corner, I guess, for somebody to pick him up. And she like got in his face and got the skateboard back. Was it a dope skateboard? Or was it was like a shitty. No, it was like a shitty. Ninja like, Turtles. We got it played against sports. Yeah. But yeah. That, you don't let people fuck with you. Well, that's it. That doesn't, he doesn't know how good that skateboard is. He's just trying yeah. to steal your shit, right? Mm-hmm. Did he know you specifically, or he just took it? No, I think he just took it. Okay. Yeah. So that's, a little, that's not as bad, right? So like, I wouldn't be as offended, because I, I don't have a problem, really, with thievery. Yeah. Um, but like, Well, like if he shook me down or something? Yeah, if he, like, if he was like, oh, that fucking kid Mike, I'm going to take his skateboard, then it's like, you got to fuck him up. Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. So your mom yelled at him. How, the kid must have been pretty young, because if, if he was over 12, I would be like, hey, cunt, get he the was, fuck out of my face. Yeah, he was probably like 12 or 13. But and he I still think took that shit? Yeah. I would have fucking spit in your mom's whore I face. I know, I know. I really would have been like, I was like, bitch, are you? I was like, I'll fuck you up, and I'll fuck up your pussy faggot kid <laughs> yeah. who's hiding in the car right <laughs> I was now. hiding in the car. <laughs> I was like, you might have a knife. <laughs> mom, no, just call the cops. <laughs> <laughs> just like screaming at me. Uh, yeah. That's fucking great. 13 yeah. year old kid just took it from an old lady. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, guess what do you do? You're still kind of scared at that time of authority. Yeah. And you, you were in the suburbs? Yeah. Yeah, where'd you grow up? Jersey. Okay, yeah. But I'm, I th- I'm so scared of confrontation because I think my parents like hit me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that'll do it to I'm you. Always yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, I'm like afraid of violence. I'm telling you. It, well, it's one or two things. You're either. You're either afraid of violence or you're extremely desensitized to it and you become violent, you mm-hmm. know? Mm-hmm. So, yeah. I am become violence. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it really is true. I, I don't want to get into a fucking peaceful parenting rant. I will right now. Let me, let me move away from it. All right. Because I've been fucking, I've been ranting. <laughs> been What's ranting. the meaning of life? The meaning of life is you have to hit your kids. <laughs> <laughs> you got to fuck them up, man. They give you lip, you crack them. You let them fucking know this is my house, my way or the highway. Do as I say, not as I do. Practice what you preach. Yeah. You know, water off a duck's back. Kill a bird with two stones. <laughs> one bird with two stones. Two birds with one stone. <laughs> Kill a bird with two stones. <laughs> Just keep on pegging that bird in the head. Give me another rock. This bird's looking. It's not dead. It's just twitching. <laughs>